How am I supposed to remember all these electrolytes? I've been there, you're not alone. Trying to remember electrolytes for nursing school and the NCLEX exam can be super challenging. But that is why I am here for you today to help you remember those most important electrolytes for your exams. These are fun and exciting ways to help you remember and hopefully have them stick in your mind and help you not forget them ever. Before we get into this video, please make sure you are subscribed to my channel and give this video a big thumbs up. But other than that, let's get into today's content. First, I am going to go over the electrolytes and second, I'm going to show you a short video by somebody else that I found that I thought was really fun and exciting and that will help you remember those electrolytes. The electrolytes that I am going to review for you today are calcium, potassium, sodium, chloride, and magnesium. Now some of these numbers and some of these little sayings I have come up with my own, others I have learned from other people like Dr. Registered Nurse. So here we go, let's get started. This one I learned from Dr. Registered Nurse and we are going to cover calcium first. Calcium, C and C, call 911. Your normal calcium level is between nine and 11. Call C, calcium C, 911, normal level is between nine and 11. Next is sodium. This one was always easy for me to remember, but if you need something to help you with sodium, think sodium has six letters in it. The lab value, the normal lab value for sodium has also six numbers in it. So six and six. Your normal lab values for sodium is between 135 to 145. Sodium, six letters. The normal lab values, six numbers. So potassium chloride and magnesium are our last three that we are going to touch. And I thought Dr. Registered Nurse had a great, great mnemonic for this kind of saying for these ones. So let's start with potassium. For potassium, think about going to the grocery store and buying a bundle of bananas. We all know bananas have a ton of potassium in them, right? Well, when you pick up that bundle of bananas, how many bananas do you typically get? About three to five. And of course, you don't wanna buy them overripe or underripe, you wanna buy them about halfway. Three to five bananas you get in a bunch, but you want them at least halfway done. So 3.5 to five is your normal potassium level. Next is chloride. And I really loved, again, Dr. Registered Nurse's view on this one. So chloride, what does that make you think of? Chlorine, which makes you think about going into the pool in the summertime. Well, what temperature do you want it to be outside when you're in a pool? About 95 degrees to 105 degrees. That's when you're gonna be swimming. Although I'll go in the pool at like 70 degrees. But 95 to 105 is your normal chloride level. Lastly is magnesium. When you see the word magnesium, you see mag in it, M-A-G, right? Mag, 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 magnify glass. That's what it makes you think of. Well, when you look through that magnify glass, things look about 1.5 to 2.5 times bigger than the usual. And that's your normal magnesium level, 1.5 to 2.5. Now, if that's a little hard for you to remember sayings and you like songs a little bit more, you need to listen to this next little video I am going to play for you. This is amazing. I can't believe it's not viral for nursing school students. This is, this is awesome. I made up songs in nursing school to help with bradycardia, tachycardia, and this rap is awesome. I wish I could take credit for it, but I can't, but let me play it here for you. This rap even tells you the signs and symptoms if something is too high or too low. So check it out, here it is. Yeah, magnesium, uh -huh. all right, thank you. Sodium, I'm notorious, na 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 na. What's all the fuss when I'm low? I'm craving confusion so high, been tacky and the weak Caesars. I could have died but when I'm high. I'm swollen, I'm thirsty all time. Seizures, agitated and I'm losing my mind. But then I met King P, potassium the king. When I'm low, slow you wave. Diuretic, spread the king. That's awesome. I this is so smart. King P. My stomach ache, and it's paralyzing me. Be careful if you're running, Ivy. Why me? The kidneys ain't clearing the king. Is it failing? 
a man to break my kidney beans. I'm running high, T waves to the sky, heart beating so fast, winky T R's I can die. Die. Man, that's a task, it ain't no joke. When you running low, you got U waves. And you gotta make sure that you True, you could die. That, that that's right. That's now. right. Listen, and when you have you All right, that was King Potassium. So Let's move on to Calcium. Calcium Cali girl. Calcium Cali girl. Y'all ready? Here she comes. I met the California girl and the beat so strong. When she's low, true soul should vex her favorite song. She's trapping season spasm. She's low. She said her heart's beating real slow. Or is it her kidneys? She don't know. Phosphorus too high or vitamin D too low. And when she's high, she ain't in the mood. Low DTRs and nausea and vomiting too. Constipated, confused, lethargic. I can't believe this. Muscle pain, bone pain is too much weakness. Now osteoporosis and, and kidney, kidney stones? stones? Let me get phosphorus on the phone. All right, we didn't go over this one, but phosphorus, Hello? here we go. Damn, Philly, I'm glad I finally caught up with you because you the only one to calm Kelly down when she's a because when you're perfect. Low, this is so you're smart. The reflex is a week. Got trouble breathing, didn't want to eat for a week. I've been hitting the bottle because I'm feeling hopeless. Oh man, I got diabetic keto acidosis. And it would help if I would eat milk and cheese. <laughs> I'll get in the sun for some vitamin D. But when I'm feeling high, Cali brings me down with the ease because I'm delirious. My nerves, I'm shaking like leaves. All right, here we go to our last one. Crying. Chloride. Oh my God, here I come, Chloride. 95 to 105. Little Chloe, now that's my baby. When she's too much, she's confused and vomiting like crazy. When she comes down, she has a little fever. Running through diapers, oh Lord. Diarrhea. Diarrhea. Woo, finally the sheriff made it to Oh, town. one more, I'm sorry, magnesium. Lights. They really going south. He works at ATP where he's breaking it down. Acts like an enzyme, says he's the baddest. It's around. Sound. When I'm high, everything is calm and slow. My blood. My heart beat, my stomach breathing is low. When one them low, I'm seizing tacky diarrhea, confused, strong DTR. It's what they're reading. What can I do? Something's going wrong. Magnesium said, Leaky vegetables. vegetables. Wait a minute, what about this the person? Was the genius. Who is this? Get out of hell. Dee Dee Simon, That's you exciting. are amazing That's for exciting. this rap. That is so extremely helpful. If you all learn this, you could use this during your test taking. You could rap in your head, put you in a good mood, and you'll go smooth sailing through your electrolyte exam. All right, everyone, but that is it for today's video. I hope those tips and tricks were helpful for you to remember those electrolytes, those most important electrolytes to remember for nursing school and for the NCLEX exam. If you have any questions, please comment down below. If you have any other mnemonics or songs, videos, stuff like that, please comment that down below as well for other students just like yourself. All right, that's it. I'll see you all in the next video. Thank you for tuning in and have a wonderful day. See ya.